Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Good afternoon. What can you say about the recent increase in the electricity tariff? Electricity tariff? It is appalling. Okay. That is the reason I've been in a compendious, laconic lacuna. Wow. Not a recapitulation. But let me tell you this. That it is Leka and Paul Cratidinus. That in a legotla, in an imbizzle, flagitious and enervating lemmatas were escogitatedly ruminated. We all saw it, how the recidivistic politicals move from budget disappearance to budget doctoration. But now we are faced with a debilitating, exasperating, a rebabative and a homongous electricity tariff. And this tariff is emanating with the financial lobotomization. But, but I pray that this will not ignite a clamorous demonstration. Now, come to think of it, how dare they deplete the citizens of their obstreperous and vociferous modus vivendi. <laughs> Enough of this vilification and solipsism. This is execrably pugnacious, pestilential, and attenuating. Imagine the imbibition of the political rhodomontes which has kept us in an abject ululation. Why? Now, now Nigeria is in a political somnabolism and malocclusion. Nigeria is in a financial and economic banditism. Look at the way the game politics is becoming a bugaboo. What a political holy bully. What a political hoity-toity. What a political foodie doody. What a political hocus pocus you have come with. What a political jabberwocky! What a political popico! What a political gobble the cock! Sir, with I'm... this consternation, I ask that you accept my pertinacious circumlocution. Accept my pertinacious circumambagos, grandiloquence, and magniloquence. But I will tell you this I will not koto in Japoho. Thank you. I will refuse to koto in Japoho.